Hey guys, welcome to Modern Woods Life. In this video, you will see us build a custom ledge in our shower. First, let's finish up running the water line to our shower faucet. We are wrapping a plastic bag around the shower valve to protect it from anything getting into its components. We decided to bring the ceiling down 3 inches by installing two 2x4s over top of each other. The 2x4s are about an inch and a half thick, so this makes up 3 inches. This will all be covered up by cement board so it doesn't have to look pretty. As you can see, we've layered two 2x4s on top of each other, and this achieved what we were trying to do. Here is another view of the water line being ran from the shower valve to the shower faucet. Johnny is cutting a divot out of the wood so that he can tuck the water line behind there. Up goes the last 2x4, then a few nails, and our ceiling is done. Now it's time to cut the pecs, measure, cut again, and drill a hole to feed our shower faucet water line through and place it exactly where we want it to be. This looks like a good place. This is where our shower faucet is going to come out, right here. There's the drain. So we'll come in like that. That. Kind of angle it. We just curved everything in real nicely. I know you're supposed to 90, but I don't want to put any cuts in it. From man block to shower valve, faucet. We had the only tee off right here over to our toilet. It's really good. You're a professional now. And I upgraded from amateur to novice. There's for the kitchen. Property line is right over there. All the way up. Straight across and it cuts across there. And we own all that. All on the other side over there. We're gonna clear out all these trees right through here. Johnny is drilling some holes through the wood. Now he is running the wire for the vent fan through the holes he just drilled to where we want the vent fan to be. Johnny is installing our vent fan which also has a light on it. How is that perfect? Literally fits in there snug. Johnny is 
drilling a hole so that we can put our vanity light exactly where we want it to be. Very nice. So we're gonna have our vanity right here, and then we have a mirror, and then the lights are gonna go up there. <laughs> Let's see what he's gonna do with that piece. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to keep up with it. building a little ledge that's gonna go around the perimeter here in like a U shape. It's gonna go here. <laughs> like that. And the ledge is gonna be all the way around. Yeah. So we're building the first ledge in the bathroom. Precise measurements. And then that's gonna be kind of like a little lip and shower. So you can put all your shampoos and your razors or whatever. And it'll be nice, be nice over that. Yep. And then this is that piece is gonna come in like that. Looking good, like it should. Now I'm trying to get this piece level, and it's looking pretty level. It's a little more to the left, so that's good, what right? What you do here is, if you pick it up there, so this is need to come up. Is it touch? Because the concrete is not perfectly level, we had to make some different height adjustments throughout the ledge. 40. Pick it up just slightly. A little bit more. Right there. Let's make that side a little bit bigger. Here they come. It's feeding time again.
because it's a little different over here. I'm just putting a piece back here to catch. It's cement board in the shower that you use. 